Yo, how's it going you guys? New Age here with another episode of our Pokemon Showdown Ladder and Sessions and today is Sunday once again, you know, like it is every week. It's always Sunday and uh, that means it's time for Pokemon of the Week over on Serebii as usual. Link will be down below in the description if you want to check out the post. Um, but this week is Genesect. I love Genesect. It's one of my favorite, like, alright, like, favorite legendary, for sure, has got to be Genesect. I don't know why, just something I love about it. Um, one of the things that might help is, I started playing competitive in X and Y, and at that time, I don't know why, but Genesect was still in OU, so I actually got to use Genesect in OU for a while, and that was... That was so much fun. And then it got banned along with Mega Mewa and Aegislash. Just all my favorites just gone. So super sad. And now Primal Groudon runs around in Ubers. So like none of them stand a chance. Um, but yeah. Pokemon of the Week Genesect. Another thing I want to point out is I have yet to do Ubers <laughs> on Showdown Laddering. Just because I don't know why Ubers is not really my thing. Uh, but we're doing it today. So we got, a lot of this stuff is like fairly standard. Um, so first off we got Choice Scarf Genesect with the download, U-Turn, Iron Head, Ice Beam, Explosion. Uh, a little bit more investment in special attack than speed. But you know, we, we still gonna be speedy. Um, let's see, then we got like some uh, hazard support. This team is like, I think fairly bulky. Um, so we got a Leftovers Klefki with the uh, spikes T-Wave Toxic, this combination is just like amazing. Um, and then play rough so we can hit stuff, we're specially defensive. Then we got, or wait, are we? Oh yeah, we are specially defensive. This is specially defensive too? Okay. Um, and then we also have a bulky Primal Groudon with Stealth Rock. So Klefki got the spikes, Groudon got the Stealth Rock. Um, then we got Precipice Blades and Lava Plume as attacks. And Roar, just so we can phase out things that want to switch in and do even more uh, damage to them would be really nice. <clears throat> Then we got like a bulky offensive defogger with Giratina. Got defog, dragon tail, shadow sneak, shadow force, all that fun stuff. Um, and then last we got choice scarf Xerneas with sleep talk moonblast. Um, just a clean up at the end of the game with moonblast. And then sleep talk is there for dark rye if they want to put us to sleep and then we have moonblast as our only move so we always hit moonblast so sleeping doesn't really affect us um and then last we got e killer arceus sd extreme speed all the all the goods along with the life orb so this thing will be like insanely powerful that's crazy <laughs> so like i said i never really played ubers i didn't even test this team i just want to jump into it because i'm like hey let's have fun with it see where it goes so Let's uh, let's hit up those Ubers and get us a game. <clears throat> All right, we got one. I don't know what I, I'm gonna be sad if I lose to this because I feel like I shouldn't lose to this. Okay, this this is indeed Ubers. The only Ubers Pokemon is Deoxys on his team. Um, Amoongus is actually kind of scary because I, my switch in for sleep is not good against that. So I don't know who I want to start with. I feel like he would start with the Moongus or Deoxys Defense. Um, part of me really just wants to lead Genesect and go for U-Turn right off the bat. It'll hit these two pretty strong and that's all I feel like he would lead off with. I mean if anything we do have good matchups against some of the other stuff too. Um, but I don't want to try and get up my hazards right away because these could have uh, Magic Bounce or Mirror Coat, whatever, whatever one it is that bounces back hazards as he's actually gonna leave with Clefable so part of me wants to like iron head are these unaware in this tier I feel like they're not but let's see Genesect at plus one attack yeah iron head straight up kills this thing I kind of want to expect him to know that though and I'm just gonna u-turn why did he stay or yeah why did he stay in hello <clears throat> I don't think he should have done that, but I'm gonna go out into Groudon. Iron Head would have just clean knocked him out. But I'm gonna go Groudon because I don't want him to T-Wave as he's gonna Calm Mind, okay. 
Okay, dude. I'm just gonna go for Precipice Blades. He can protect here. I'm gonna go for Stealth Rock now. In case he wants to try and switch out into, like, Dragonite or something. Why are you staying in? What are you doing, bro? As he gets a special attack drop. And I think here, I kind of want to just go back out into Genesect. I feel like he's going to protect again, maybe. Or Calm Mind. Yeah. Nah, bro. I'm, you're, you're getting iron-headed. I don't know why you stayed in to begin with, but I do have rocks up now, so that's nice. Uh, that could break multi-scale and hit Pinsir pretty hard. I mean, he could rapid spin them away if he really wants to, and I kind of have to switch out here because I am scarfed into Iron Head. I mean, depending on what he wants to go out into, you know? So he is going to go out into him on top. I kind of wish I had Will-O-Wisp on this Giratina, but we're going to go out into Giratina anyways. Um, he has Mock Punch, so Mock Punch, Rapid Spin, probably close combat. And one other move, I really don't think he could touch me. Um, I am just going to go for Dragon Tail here. Okay. Well, can't Rapid Spin on me, bro. I don't know if you knew that already or what, but... And I think here I want to go out into Xerneas just to let him put me to sleep. Because this is the only one I don't mind being put to sleep because I do have Sleep Talk. And now he can't put anything else on my team to sleep. So, let's see. He's got Poison and Grass. I feel like Klefki is good here. I can start to get up my spikes and he can't really touch me. Um, as he's going to go out into Dragonite now. And I think I want to Thunder Wave. I mean, I was going to say I guess I could like uh, play rough, but I guess this thing has Hidden Power of Fire. <laughs> if he like went straight back out into this. <clears throat> Unless he's going to try and put me to sleep again, but he's going to learn the hard way that uh, Sleep Claws is a thing. I'm assuming he doesn't know yet. Just because he stayed in on my Clefable. Or with his Clefable. And did other things too. <laughs> oh, and uh, tried to hit my Giratina with Mach Punch and all that. Okay, well, I have all three layers of my spikes up, so... I mean, if you want to just stay in, that's, that's on you. <laughs> I don't really know what to do here. I could just start firing off Ice Beams, I guess, if I really wanted to. He doesn't really have a switch for that. Or try and sweep him with uh, Arceus. That would be fun. As he's going to go out into Deoxys. So this is really awesome because I can U-turn on this thing and it'll just die. We got the attack boost. We're good to go. So rip this Deoxys. <laughs> and um, I think I might want to go out into Groudon now. I don't know. Actually... Yeah, I want to go Arceus to maybe bring out his Hitmontop, so then I could phase it out again with Dragon Tail. Yeah, that's that's what I really want to happen. Because he can't touch my Giratina, unless he has Toxic. I mean, that could be a thing, but... Nah, bro, sorry, not happening. And I'm going to go for Dragon Tail. That would be kind of awesome if he switched out. So yeah, Bullet Punch was his only other move. Otherwise, he had nothing to touch me, so Hazards are here to stay. Dragonite already took a lot. Uh, Pinsir is going to be taking even more because it's going to get hit by the spikes. And I am just going to Dragon Tail again here because then, well, he's at 51%, so he'll go down to 1%, but I don't want him to be able to set up on me. And he's not going to be able to touch me here either. So we should be chilling. This is the only reason why I didn't get any practice games in because I didn't want to ladder up in Ubers. Okay, so yeah, Pinsir's gonna die when it comes back out. Um, so, I don't know what I want to do here. I want to go out into Genesect, I guess. I keep getting attack boost instead of special attack boost. Oh, I was scared for a second. I thought that was Hidden Power Fire. I guess that's Ice then. Yeah, that would make sense. I mean, that works too. I was gonna start firing off Ice Beams. The whole rest of his team is weak to Ice Beam. Nothing could switch in on it. And it'll knock out everything that he's got left. So, that is most definitely going to be GG. Yeah, because uh, all speed Dragonite and Pinsir can't come in. It dies to hazards. <clears throat> so there's the Dragonite. That'll go down too. 
462 speed. Oh my gosh. So Dragonite's gone and Pinsir will go down too. Not bad. <laughs> so now we can find us another game and it'll probably be worse this next time around playing against actual legendaries. All that good stuff, but let's let's see what we got. All right. <laughs> Why do people bring these things in Ubers? This dude All right, let me tell you the only reason this guy is here. It's because Greninja with protein is in Ubers and he's like, "Got to use Greninja with protein." So I might as well have the rest of this team in Ubers. Once again, if I lose to this, I'm going to cry. Um I definitely feel like I can lead Groudon. He can't paralyze me. I'm I'm just pretty sure I match up really well against everything. And getting a Brox would be huge. No! 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 I wanted to beat him! I wanted to beat Ash! Damn it. Let's find him again. What are these teams? <laughs> this is... And they forfeit? Why do they forfeit? They're just giving me all these points for free. I'm gonna have to battle against actual legendaries. Or are these people like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna play in Ubers, but if I see a single legendary, I'm out. Nah. This is weird. The lower ladder is a scary place. All right, we got an actual team. Yo, I'm legitimately afraid of Mewtwo. Like, legit. I don't know how that is defeated. I also don't really know how I beat Groudon on this team. Like, maybe Arceus. I know Genesect, if it gets a special attack boost, Ice Beam will do, like, a decent amount, but... I don't know, dude. I don't know what he's gonna lead with, either. I might have to, like, Toxic it with Klefki right off the bat. Losing my spikes would kind of suck, but... I feel like that's what I need. As he's gonna lead with Xerneas. Okay. I don't want him to Earthquake me, though. If anything, he's gonna SD right off the bat. I'm not Thunder Wave. Yeah, okay. Um. <laughs> and now what? I feel like I need Giratina for Mewtwo. I don't want to go out into that. But he can't Earthquake me or hit me with a normal move. Oh my gosh, this man SD him four times. Alright, I'm gonna attempt a Dragon Tail. Roar of Time? Hello? First off, that's a special move. So that was just weird. Second, he is going out into... Well, he got forced out into a Giratina now. Um, he might will with me. I think I really want to Toxic this thing, though. Whoa. Um, I really want to get up rocks, too. I mean, I could go Groudon and get up my rocks. That's something. I, I'm going to try. Unless he wants to like defog them right away. But getting up my, ro my rocks would be pretty cool. And he did Shadow Force, so I mean, we know he's not switching here. For sure, getting up the rocks. And I think here I kind of want to roar, maybe? I don't know why. I feel like I want to roar. He's going to Draco and crit me. Oh my gosh. So the roar honestly just helped him. I should have went for Precipice Blades. Ew, I'm kind of sacking my ground on right now, but I don't want to do that. Alright, I'm just going to go for Precipice Blades, I guess. And he's Mewtwo Y. Oh my gosh. And he has Psy Strike. Alright, well I'm going to go out into Genesect and U-Turn. Because that will blow this thing back. And if he stays in the and he's faster, he wrong. Yeah, he's going to switch. So he's going to go Groudon. I swear I don't have anything for this. I have to go Klefki and Toxic him. That's like my only option. I guess I should have made a team more suited to take on Groudon, but, you know, I don't really have recovery either. Oh my gosh, he has Eruption. Calm down, dude. Eruption, I think, will still kill Genesect, too. So I think I want to go Garrett. Mm. Would he be max speed? Because I want to go Giratina and Shadow Force, but... Can I win? I think I can still win this with Arceus, but... I don't like that my Arceus doesn't have recovery. I'm going to go out into Giratina. And hope that he's... Not... Not max speed. 
and we're gonna go for Shadow Force. <clears throat> I actually don't like going for Shadow Force because it gives his it gives his Arceus a free SD, but he does decide to go Giratina instead, so I'll take that. Uh, we should be faster than this too. Yeah. Oh my gosh. What the? <laughs> See, this is why I don't play Ubers because I don't know how much damage these things do, and that was ridiculous. All right, I don't know what he's gonna do right here either. I don't think Moonblast does too much this game. I also kind of have nothing for Dalga. Like, part of me wants to stay in and hope he Dracos so I can set up with Arceus on him and win. I think that's, I think that's a thing that I need to do. Should I try and Shadow Force? Yeah, I'm gonna Shadow Force. Yeah, because I know he's definitely gonna attack me, but I wanna weaken him here. Oh my gosh, Giratina, chill. Alright, so that didn't work out extremely well just because I was hoping he would go for Draco Meteor. But why does he have Roar of Time? Alright, Dalga versus Xerneas. Oh, Moonblast actually knocks him out. Alright, I think at this point I'm gonna go into Xerneas and just fire off as many Moonblasts as I can before I go down. Oh, he has to recharge? Ooh. Oh, I wish I knew that then. I would have went out to Arceus and set up. That's a little unfortunate. As he's gonna go on to his own Arceus, I don't think he can knock me out. Okay. I would hope that doesn't knock me out, but I'm gonna Moonblast here anyways. Yeah, as he gets paralyzed. Alright, cool, cool, cool. It's looking like I could come through with this. Yeah. I'm gonna Moonblast here, too. Like, hello? Get out of here. I don't know why he's not going Groudon, either. Like, he's letting, he's letting me weaken his whole team. And if anything, Groudon just dies to, like, Explosion now from my Genesect. He's gonna side Strike. We live in, boys! Yeah, we're just clicking Moonblast like a madman. I mean, this would have been the same situation with Arceus. If uh, I had known that he had to recharge. I don't play these Pokemon. I don't know these rules. He's going to Precipice Play. That's going to knock us out. And then your boy Genesect is going to come through with the kill. GG. Because it's his week. It's Genesect's week. So we win in battles up in here with Genesect. Let's get another one. All right. Damn it. I was going to say, we have to choose a Pokemon fast. Because he's gonna leave. Yo, we're like ranking up like a madman. All these forfeits, they don't wanna face the Genesect squad. Let's get another game. Alright, we got one with an Azumarill. Ha! That's funny and cool. I feel like I have nothing for Kyogre either. Like, actually nothing. Maybe Genesect. I'll like have to explode. Um, once again, I feel like I need to lead Klefki just in case he leads Groudon so I can try and toxic it. I don't like doing that. I mean, I guess, in a sense, Giratina beats Groudon, too. I also just want to Thunder Wave this. What is Rayquaza gonna do? Hello? Hello? I'm gonna get up a spike. Is he Defog Arceus? What the hell? This isn't... Oh, yeah, no. What? What is happening right now? Is he, like, weakness policy? I'm just gonna keep getting up all my hazards. <laughs> I hope he gets paralyzed on the next one. Like, Blizzard is gonna do nothing to me, bro. Oh my gosh. Alright, well, there's a move you could hit me with. Um, I'm just gonna play rough. Damn, that does a lot. Okay, well... Just kind of hoping he wouldn't hit me with another one. He does have extreme speed that does do 20%. So I'm not I'm not having that one. Um, like I said, I do need to save this thing. Hmm. And he has a Mewtwo as well. I don't want to let this thing die. If anything, I might go like Genesect. 
I really want to go Groudon because I can try and get up my rocks. But I don't know how much he's going to do to me. Uh, let's just go Groudon, get up the rocks. Maybe I'll get paralyzed. Or go for E-Speed is what I'm hoping. Why are you going for Dragon Descent? Why? Can you get paralyzed though? Or not go for Dragon Descent? What's wrong with this dude? I'm like wasting all my Pokemon. Why are you making these plays? I'm going for U-Turn. Yeah, get out of here. It's okay, I got up all my hazards. Kind of worth. Maybe. I don't know. Who do I even go out into here? I shouldn't have done that. Um, I'm gonna go Klefki again. If he goes ground on, I'm just gonna toxic it. Oh, and we and we get some nice little leftovers. Okay. Okay. I mean, Klefki is like support to anything that wants to come out. So I also don't know what kind of Arceus he is. Does it say? No, it doesn't. Uh, he's gonna go ground on though, so I'm definitely gonna toxic this thing. Cause that that needs to happen. As he's gonna earthquake, Clefki's gonna go down. And now I'm gonna go Giratina. And I think I'm gonna shadow force. Hope I'm faster. I mean he could be yeah, he's defensive. Sweet! Yo, Giratina is a good like toxic style Pokemon. Not only does it hit hard, but it like what <laughs> Okay, but I think Giratina is a really good answer to Groudon. Can't hit me with Precipice Blades and I resist the uh, the fire move. As here, I'm definitely going to go for Shadow Sneak. Yeah, I'm faster than him too. Okay, as he play refs. Oh my gosh, why did we eat that? Like a most delicious sandwich. Um, and I'm going to Shadow Force here because now he can't Belly Drum, so I'm not worried. I was just trying to knock him down to a citrus, so then um, if he did belly drum, I could just knock him out with another shadow sneak after. <clears throat> so Giratina putting in the work. I never realized Giratina was like this good. Um, as he's gonna go Kyogre here, there's actually a speed type, he's max speed. And I don't know what he's gonna do, if he's just gonna ice beam me. Or what? Because I kind of want to save this for Mewtwo still. And his last Pokemon is Arceus. I'm going to go Genesect and U-Turn. Because it'll be nice and bubba boasted. Oh my gosh, that does so much. Is that how much it's supposed to do? Primal Kyogre? Um, okay. It's not... It's not really what I was thinking. Um... Defensive? 21 to 26. That did a lot. Well, I mean, it can't have a specific item. So, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, and here I'm just gonna go Giratina again. That's the best thing we have to take a water move. Not well. Oh, not well. And we're gonna Shadow Sneak, knock him out! Yo, Hazard's coming in clutch. I'm loving it. So he's got Mewtwo and Arceus left. If he goes Arceus, I'm just gonna Dragon Tail. Because if he doesn't attack me and tries to SD, then I get to phase him out. And he is normal Arceus. So, yeah, Dragon Tail is a coming. Because I don't mind if he knocks me out here because then he doesn't get the boost. And I think between Scarf Genesect and Scarf Xerneas, I can beat whichever variant of Mewtwo it is. So I'm kind of chilling. And I think from here, um, if he does knock me out, I might just go Xerneas. Because it'll 2 it KO Arceus, and I don't think he knocks me out with like plus 2 extreme speed. Curious now. As he decides to go for E speed, I don't know why. Um, Arceus. 
Plus two. Oh my gosh. It, well, it does knock me out from full. Plus two extreme speed. As I'm going to Shadow Sneak here, and that's going to do a bunch of damage. And at this point, um, yeah, Arceus is solo. Ah, I should have let, uh, should have let Genesect come in and clean up, actually, with Iron Head. Alright, let's just pretend this is this Genesect right here. Pokemon of the week, up in his piece, cleaning up Arceus with Iron Head. Oh, and he's gone. Alright, cool. Not even bad. We're at 1200 on the ladder. Talk about a boss. Alright, we'll get one more game. Yeah, sorry if this one is a bit shorter. I don't have as much time tonight. It's a busy day. So, we're going to wrap it up with this game. He's got a uh, Gengar. That's scary. Um, I kind of really want to lead with Groudon. I, I really don't see why not. Because I can get up my rocks too, which is what I want. As he's going to lead Ferrothorn. And I'm just going straight for my rocks here. Like, he's definitely got a switch. He can't go for a water move. He could toxic me, most definitely, which is why I think I want to go out into my Klefki here. I can toxic this back and start to get up my spikes. Yeah, because otherwise he, he was doing nothing to me. Um, he does have a lot of steel types. I think I want to go for Thunder Wave, actually. As Toxic would have been a lot better against Milotic, because I could have wore it down. So I kind of regret that now, I just kind of figured he would switch. I mean, just like I expected the Toxic on him, he should expect the Toxic from this. But I guess not. But I can just stay in and get on my hazards. Um, I don't even think he has a way to remove them. So that's pretty nice. As you know, just... Just waiting for some paralysis, that's all. Okay. Just just patiently awaiting the paralysis. Any day now. This turn would be uh, awesome for that. Great turn for paralysis coming up right now. Ah, nope. Okay. Luckily, we didn't get burned, so we got up all three layers of spikes. We're going to go ground on now. And... I guess go for Precipice Blades. I really don't want to let my Groudon get poisoned, but... I mean, I don't really think I have anything else that can beat this. All my team is like physical attackers too, and if he's like Marvel scale... Wait. Which, which one raises Marvel scale? Defense. Okay, so it'd be better to hit him on the special side, actually. So I think I'm going to go Xerneas and just start going for Moonblast here. I don't even want to calc how much this is going to do. <laughs> I'm going to. Um, if he's physically defensive, Moonblast does a decent amount. If he's special defensive, Moonblast does not do much. But if he gets paralyzed once, we can beat him with Moonblast. So, we're going out into Milotic here, or sorry, Xerneas here against the Milotic to start firing off Moonblast. He doesn't really have a switch. I mean, he does have switches, but if he wants to switch out, that's fine because I have switches for his switches, you know? So, we're chilling. We aren't scared. I am happy that he didn't get the burn on Klefki. That's nice. So, he does go for Scald there, doesn't burn me. As we're going to go for Moonblast. He might want to switch here. That's all fun and dandy. I mean, he could try and switch expecting me to Geomancy, but nah. Ooh, damage! Okay, so Moonblast knocks him out. We are faster. Because we Scarfed. So we get the knockout on Gengar, which is really nice. I'm guessing he's Mega Blaziken then. I don't think there's a switch. My friend, Mega Blaziken, yeah, you, you die. Will you be faster than me? I, 
You're not even faster than me at plus one, yo. Okay, well, Lazykin is dead. So, two of his pretty big threats gone. Um, I'm definitely saving. Okay, well, he forfeited. <laughs> um, I think we definitely had this one in the bag. Like, unless he was able to somehow sweep with Aegislash, which I don't really think could have happened because I had Roar and Dragon Tail and Groudon. Um, I, I don't really think he could have swept us. I also had Arceus too, so we couldn't Shadow Sneak my team to death. Like, I have Earthquake on it. So, I definitely don't think he was going to win that one. Unfortunately, I will have to end it off on that. It would have been nice to actually win the game, but... Hey, the team was a lot of fun. I didn't say that much. Or at least on the lower ladder. I don't know how good it would do against actual competitive Ubers teams. And I can't guarantee that I'll play Ubers again anytime soon. Just because it's not really my thing. Maybe one day it'll be not at the moment but hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did be sure to leave a like and as usual the link to the Cerebi post about genesect and pokemon of the week and all that good stuff will be down below in the description so until then you guys i'm new age steel keep on watching i'll see you in the next video later